five. And now out comes Minnesota. And this game comfortably in hand. The scoreboard speaks for itself, but you still got your starting quarterback out there. When, when do you go to the backup, let him get some time? And that's one of the great questions in the NFL, Brandon, because I'm just going to tell you, in the 2015 season, I commentated on three games in a row that were blowouts. And in none of them did the starting quarterback ever come out of the game for the team that had a big lead. And in each instance, I asked the coaches later on, why didn't you do that? And they all looked at me and said, just don't really do that in the NFL. We, we you know these guys play, and we just play them all the way through. Now, in certain situations, they will take them out. But for the most part, they're not as worried and concerned about getting them out of the game. And that's always puzzled me a little bit. It's a four-yard pick up there, and it leaves them with third and five. They don't need to run another play here before the two-minute warning. Let's see if they do it anyway. On third down, here's Williams. Look at the spin. Balance. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. That good for 22 and a first down. So the Vikings in possession of the football as we get you reset. And they have just about put this one on ice as they've got it here, first and 10. Now a man who's been busy this afternoon, it's Williams. And he's going to work this one down to about the five. It's a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. Well, partner, I know this type of running back. I mean, this size, this intensity usually gets better as the game goes on. And I can just tell you from experience, the first few quarters, oh, you're eager. You come running up there. I'm going to tackle this guy. By the fourth quarter, you're coming up and thinking about it. And D-line wearing down fourth quarter. Yeah, that's not a guy they want to see consistently. A five-yard gain, and now they're set up first and goal. Uh, he's still rumbling, isn't he? Still looking fresh in this one, despite the heavy workload. But you and I both know, well-conditioned, and he did tell us that he thrives on being at his peak late in ball games. They come out here in the eye. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he will get in.